Happy New Year, guys. Welcome back to All That Matters. Yes, it's 2024. I know. I can't believe it either. Today, the whole day, I kept writing 2023. Then I had to remind myself it's 2024. But Happy New Year. I hope it has started well for you. It has sta- it started great for me, but I'm half asleep. So we'll try again tomorrow and we'll see how it goes. But welcome to All That Matters. I am your girl. Akuba Jasmine. I hope you guys are all doing well. Please don't forget to hit the subscribe button, the follow button, and the like button on all our social media platforms. It's Revolt Media. Now, before the show starts, let's say thank you to our powerful sponsors who keep it going. Quick Copy, formerly known as Inkwell. If you need for all your printing needs, whether it's book printing, business cards, flyers, carbonless forms, posters, photos, invoices, canvas, all re- retractable banners, Retractable banners, rolling banners, whatever banner you're looking for, calendars, booklets, flyers, greeting cards, invitations, all your printing needs, you can reach out to Inkwell. They're located on 1900 East Dublin Granville Road, Columbus, Ohio, 43229. Or you can give them a call on 614-888-2201. Believers Attire. Listen, it's a Christian themed t shirt which aims to start conversations and affirm our trust in God. They have amazing shirts. They have God is my president, as we already know, we are entering election time. So we already know God is for sure our president. Say, always say a prayer ASAP. Um, you are fearful, you are amazing worthy and ca- you are amazing worthy and capable yes um my person my new personal favorite leave it to god and go to sleep and so many more pray big pray big worry small trust god laugh more stress less and have faith and um so many many more if you want one of their shirts you can reach out to believe us attire it's 220-465-0822 Akuba, all for all your natural hair and skincare needs, with, which is nourishing and gentle and effective. It is made from the finest ingredients, ensuring quality results. 2024, we don't want to hear, I have acne, I'm breaking out, I'm this, my hair is now growing. We don't want to hear it because we've already given you the what you need to do and you just don't want to do it. But if you want healthy hair and healthy skin this year, reach out to Akuba. It's www www.akuba.com or you can read call 614-584-1845 Lona Soul Clothing yeah yeah it's exclusive oh yeah I'm so sorry Akuba you can use um code revolt for 30% off yes the code is revolt for 30% off so yeah Lona Soul Clothing it's an exclusive streetwear Okay, they have 3D print Lona Soul t-shirt, which is available in black and white. They have Lona Soul shorts, which is available in tan and gray. Get yours now. They are currently offering, I think it's still going on, if you use the code Lona, which is L-O-N-E-R, you can get $30 off. Okay, listen, buy your summer shorts and put it there, because summer is coming quicker than we can say, duh. So, yeah, get your shorts, get your shirts. Right now, you can go or head over to lonasoulstreetwear.com for your shirts and your shorts. RG Kids Portrait. They specialize in maternity kits and baby shoots. It comes with decor. If you miss their Christmas special, it's okay. They still got you. Just book them right now for all our expecting mothers, our um, mothers that just had a baby. Just reach out to RG Kids Portrait. They will take care. Or mothers with small children, you want to capture the first birthday, second birthday, the whole nine yards. Reach out to RG Kids Portrait, and they will take care of that for you. You can find them on Instagram. It's RG underscore kids underscore portrait. Or you can give them a call on 614-254-2151. Glorious Studios, an all-in-one studio destination for meetings, dance class, photo shoots, 
podcast, music video recording, content creation, set design. Listen, you don't need to go buy any equipment. All you have to do is call Gloria Studios and they will take care of you. So if you want to start a podcast, you want to shoot a video, you need a space, you need decoration, you need mics, whatever it is that you're looking for, reach out to Gloria Studios. That You can find them on 6, you can give them a call on 614-551-4845. Or you can find them on or you can find them on 723 Taylor Avenue. With that said, oh, wait, I'm sorry, I'm forgetting one more. I was about to skip down. I did. I was about to skip one. Rock Vine Valentine's Dinner and Dance. Who I am looking forward to it. We're already in January, so it's next month. It's exactly a month after my birthday. Exactly one month. So you don't you know it's special if it's exactly one month after the Queen's birthday. February 17th. You don't want to miss out on it. It's happening at the Eastern Hilton Hotel at 5 30 p.m. Look, I know last year a few of us met, saw Kwabna Kwabna, but you know you didn't get the vibe that you were looking for. But this year, we promise to bring that to you. You're going to get the Kwabna Kwabna that you've been waiting for. And our very own C will also be there. If you don't know who C is, I don't know if you guys remember Mentor. Mikai, 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 yeah. Well, if you don't know who that is, Pull up and you'll get to know her. There'll be live band, there'll be um, food, drinks, and many, many more. You don't want to miss out on it. Come out. Listen, you work so hard. Just one day, come out, celebrate. Let's have a great, great time. The flyer is on the screen if you are watching. Get your tickets. Let's have a good time. Come look beautiful and let's have a great time. And of course, the queen will be on the red carpet. So you already know. You already not only associate with things that are great, okay? So pull up. Let's have a great, great time. It's happening February 17th at 5.30 p.m. Whew, that was a mouthful, but thank you guys. Thank you guys so much for supporting. We truly appreciate it. And now, Aya, let's get the show started. Let's get it on the road. Are you ready? Are you ready? I am here with the man who needs no introduction, my favorite bullheaded melanin man. How are you, Kumasi? I'm all right. How you doing? I'm sleepy, but we're here. Well, we move. It's 2024. You need to cut all the sleep. Yeah, 2024, but what do you mean I have to cut the sleep? Hold on. Okay. You can't be say I'm sleepy. Man, Don't worry. Come with energy. I'm going to wake it's 2024. up. 2024. <laughs> No, I have all. Th- and <laughs> I have all the energy. Just today, the energy decided to take a break. Okay, I used it all for the Christmas holiday. <laughs> today, mm. it needs a vacation. Okay, mm-hmm. but how are you? How's your? I'm good. I'm really good. How's your New Year? It's been good. What did you do on New Year's Day? Don't join our producer. What did you do? New you Year's did Day. That was yesterday. That was. Yesterday. yesterday, yesterday was the first. Today's the yeah, second. I was I was in the house all day. Mm. I was in the house all day. At night, I took my kids uh, uh, and, and drive around, shot off area. Oh, that's yeah. cute. Yeah, that was it. Basically, that was it. I didn't do anything. I stayed home all day. That's good. I was about to say I made shit up, but I, I forgot that was Sunday. You made on Sunday. Was it Sunday? Uh, it was 31st. I did it on 31st. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. It was 31st. Yeah. Well... I, I did nothing. But yeah, our show today, our show is, was, is produced by our one and only Chevy with the X. But yeah, so you did nothing? Yeah, nothing. Did you go to church on Sunday? Yes, I did. You know, this year I realized mean, so many. Morning or evening? I went. Uh, <laughs> I don't, I just don't understand. Why? Like, if we have a special day mm-hmm. like 31st and it falls on the morning, mm-hmm. I mean, on I mean on a Sunday, you shouldn't go to church. We can't Sunday. miss two of friends. <laughs> She didn't go to they can't up. miss two offering. Sunday. If you miss, if you close on Sunday morning, that means you're missing morning offering. But what if it didn't happen on a, on the same day? If it didn't, then that means they've gotten their Sunday offering and they'll get their Tuesday offering, whichever one. <laughs> because you know this is the moment where the pastors have to cash it's just, in. It's just I just I just feel like I wish mm-hmm. if I if I'm a I'm a pastor. I wouldn't do that. Some places didn't open. Like, I wouldn't, I wouldn't, you, will you, in all honesty, expect somebody in the space of uh, a couple of hours? So, let's say you go to church at 10, right? Mm-hmm. Church is over at church at, let's say, 10, close to 2. Mm-hmm. And then you want them to come back at 8. 8 o'clock, yeah. When they have kids. People did it. 
I mean, people did it, but come I, on. I think people only did it because and it's somebody tradition. Go, somebody's going to be like, oh, but it's, it, it happens once. It doesn't matter. Yeah. I think it's too much. Well, I that's did the night, though. See. I did. I did the night. You went. I did both. I did the night. I did both. Yeah. That, yeah. It's one of the worst thirty first I've had. I'm not even going to thirty first again. Oh, why? I feel like it was too packed. Oh, because that's where all the it, it was. It was, like, it was too packed. Mm-hmm. It was too noisy. Like yeah. I didn't really get a message. I don't know. Enough of that. Let, let, let's. You know, 31st night is where everybody comes to church. Even the kids, they never see them throughout the year. 31st, I don't even want to ask the producer if he went to church. Because him, I know yeah, he didn't. see, Kwame Mike says, shout out to Covenant Place Ministries. Where we did only night. Yeah, they did only night. Yeah. I wanted to go if to there. I actually, but I couldn't. Yeah. I think, I think I'm think i leaning more towards Covenant Place, man. Shout out to Pastor B. I was yeah, there on Friday. I'm, I'm, I haven't been able to go, but... I will, I will have to. Now, looking at my schedule, is tough right now for me to. Yeah, bro. <laughs> yeah. Father of the year. Well, today, are you ready for what we're going to talk about? Yeah. So, we already know new year, new me. So, yesterday, I read something on Instagram. On Instagram, They said, since the new year started on a Monday, we know this year is going to be great. We know Monday is like the beginning of a work week, right? So this year is going to be very productive. I don't know how true that is, but I that's support what it. Saying. Yeah, that's what's I, on I, Instagram. I will hope it becomes I support productive, it. but I think this year is going to be a lot of chaos. I feel like this year is going to be my happy year. Oh, good. I for pr- me, I personally, I, I feel like this year will be my happy year because I feel like that's... I ended 2023 on a, on a high note, okay. like on a positive note. Like okay. there was a little chaos... In December, but I feel like I ended it on a positive, especially like surrounded by, by the people that I love, the people I care for. So I really feel like this year will be my happy year. Good. And the pastor made a mistake and texted me that. So I was like, it's official. <laughs> it's going to be a happy year. Okay. Oh, good for you. Good for you. <laughs> I don't care what anybody else says. Good for you. <laughs> but yeah, so today we are going to talk about a new year. Mm. What are you going to do different? You know, we start the year with resolutions. You know, I wanna, I wanna lose hundred pounds. I wanna do this. I wanna do this. But you know, with all the writing, right? I think one of the things I noticed: you can write everything down, but if you don't put action behind it, that's all nothing it is. is going to happen. Yeah, that's all it is. It's access. You don't so, even have to write; you have to act. Oh, this year, people people write though. Like before the end of the year, I think I stopped doing that two years ago. Before the end of everybody's writing. New Year's, I want to travel to this place. I want to do this. I want to do that. And by December, if not accomplish none of it. You know, so yeah. What is one thing? I know what I'm doing different. I think for me, with this year, one of the things, I want to do friendships and relationships differently. I want to do career and um, finances differently. And I think I want to bet on myself more this year compared to like previous years or last year. I can say last year. I think with this new year, I want to bet on myself. So whether it's friendships, I want friendships that serve purpose. Right. I no longer want friendship because I want friendships. Just being a woman, we make friends randomly, right? But I think for me now, I want friendships that reap something. If you're my friend and you're not bringing anything, you know, that will help my growth. Right. I love you from a distance, you know. So that's one of the things this year when I was sitting there at the end of last year, I was like, I really want friendships that bring purpose. And in relationship, I want to open myself up to love. I do. This time, this time I think I really, I know last year you kept saying, (laughs) because I don't want to. That is the reason. But I feel like I limited myself because of one or two things. But I think this year I want to open myself because I feel like I'm getting old. 35 is creeping up. So we... Why are you so worried about getting old? Yeah, look at gonna, you. Because you're going to be old anyway. Dang. Dang. So far as you eat, so far as you sleep. You're going gonna to be old. old. No, I think I just want to open myself up to real proper love. Of like course. a good, solid companion. That's Not just for fun. Yeah. yeah, that's 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 what everybody has to yearn for. Yeah, it's unfortunate that um this generation preaches society um preaches for a uh, fun instead mm-hmm. of companion. You know, so a man cannot even speak to a woman. You cannot tell a woman that hey, mm. you know, don't do this. It's controlling instead of looking at it like it's love. Mm. You know, you can look at it any way you want to. When a man loves you, mm-hmm. he will like to correct you. Of course, that's what yeah. that's how men are. If men don't correct you, they don't love you. Mm. You know? 
But some men can't correct themselves to come and correct me. I'm telling you, some men can do stuff that they know it will break them. Mm-hmm. They'll still do it, but they wouldn't let their loved ones do that. Mm. You know? So the fact that sometimes people say, oh, why are you doing why are you doing this? And you are telling me not to do yeah. it. Maybe I'm doing it so you can get somewhere to stand. You may not understand. So you just listen. You just do what you are being told. That's it. It's not control. It's love. Okay. We'll see about that. It's not controlling, you know. Oh yeah, it's, it's I'm love. Very, like if me, I tell mm-hmm. you, Jasmine, hey, when you come to the radio, I want you to stay focused. And, mm-hmm. You know, I say, oh, but when you come, you are my, you are on your phone. Okay, when I'm sitting, I'm on my phone, but you probably don't know what I'm doing. Yeah, I'm sharing the links. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm mm-hmm. saying? Oh, Jasmine, follow the conversation because if you are gonna host the show, if you don't follow the conversation. How are you going to be able to ask what are questions mm-hmm. on your phone? Okay. Oh, but when you see here, you go on your phone. Well, I don't have anybody to manage this for me, to share all this stuff. I have to mm-hmm. do that. You, you want to be in that situation? No. Okay, then follow the conversation. <laughs> okay. So, it, it, you know what I'm saying? I get what you're you may from. You may think, oh, I'm not, I'm, I'm not preaching what I'm, pr- I'm not uh, practicing, practicing what I'm what preaching. what you're preaching. But in my situation, it's different. Yeah. So that's why it is. Well, that's true. And and for me too, if I if I'm with a person, I want a person that will be able to correct me. So if a person goes with the flow with everything I do, I become very bored and I just look at you like no disrespect to men, but it looks like you ain't got no backbone. You get what I mean? If I can run over and do but, whatever. But, but, but you people are making us this way. The thing is y'all just put all of us in one bubble. So then y'all decide to treat all of us the same. Yo, you tell me right now, how many percent of women even take words from men. A few will. How many percent? Just give me give me a percentage. I'm the one person. See, so <laughs> I can only speak if, for if, myself. If we are dealing with the one percent. <laughs> it's not. It's a nominal. You I know? feel like there is more out there. We just. I think the the thing is. Sis, I feel like sis, the ones who are not. Sis, I have yes. seen it. Man, I've lived this life. Over yeah, four but decades, I, right? I feel like I'm the ones you, who I are not are over allowed. Have you seen? Power. Have you seen our universities these days? Hmm. Mm. But there's nothing you can you can really say. Mm-hmm. Have you seen um even what is going on? Have you ever have you ever heard a statement called black man power? Yeah, I've heard black man power. Black man power. Yeah. You've heard you probably heard black woman power. Oh, it is black women. Oh, damn, sorry black men. <laughs> damn. I'm tell, it, 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 I'm just telling you that this whole thing is to wrestle against men. Mm-hmm. So, what do you do as a man? You just shut up. So most men at this point in their lives are sh- they like we just shut up. We're not even gonna say anything and go with the flow. Yeah, but what can I do? Mm. Like, what can I really do? Like, you know, we can't do nothing. So we just shut up and let it go. And then when it the the plane crashes, <laughs> it becomes our fault again. Yes, it is. <laughs> you know, so. I think y'all should just not put all of us in one bubble. Y'all should open up and we only allow yourselves to be loved. I think that's the problem I think I'm seeing with a lot of black men. You guys have a guard. Like, allow yourselves to be loved. We will, we will wish you guys can love us. But when y'all see a but good what, woman, you don't what, see a good but, woman? But why you, you guys have proven to us it's hard for us to. Wait, you guys don't see a good woman when a good woman is in front of you? I, no, I'm being serious. Thinking, Y'all don't see a good you, woman. You are, you are even talking to somebody, a personality, a gender that would take somebody from the ground and take care of them regardless of their status. Yeah. You can't even say this. We would do everything for a woman. Men would do everything for women. Mm-hmm. A man would just, a, a man with a doctorate would just pick somebody from the streets. Oh, yeah. Probably we'll never had a job before. Time. Take care of them, put them on a pedestal. <clears throat> women don't do that. So when you say we don't even. Open ourselves to be loved. If we can't love that low, why can't we put ourselves to be loved? I feel like we the, get disappointed all the time. That's the problem. So because you guys get disappointed by other women, you guys it's, have a guard when like no, a good not, woman comes it's around. Not, it's not. It's not the other woman. It has been. How do I put it so I don't offend nobody? Because this said, is weird. <laughs> in my, wait, wow, this shit you don't want to hurt people's feelings. No, no, no. I, I, I'm trying to. Um, I'm trying to mm. put it in a way. Because my goal is to help women, right? It's not to diminish women. Mm-hmm. And it seems most women get what I say wrong. Yeah, we... Uh, you know what I'm saying? Most do. women get what I say wrong. Mm-hmm. Like, when I say, like, if you're over 35 years, no man should marry you. Mm-hmm. I'm not saying that if you're 35, you don't deserve to be loved. 
That's not what I'm saying. I'm saying that you have from 17 to uh, uh, 35, that's 17 years. If you couldn't find a mind to love, you've wasted majority part of your time. It's not like we couldn't. It's not like we're not even looking. The, the, it's just that the, the there men... are so many men that you guys have passed on. I... Good men that would treat you like cranes that you've passed on for a one night flank for something that is trivia. And that's what I'm speaking against. It's not like I'm diminishing any woman. I'm trying to think of the good men I passed on. There are so many. Before I turned 29. I'm, you, I'm really trying your, to think, but I've not met if any your, good guys. If you all sit down and have conversations, I bet you deep, deep in your heart, you know, ah, this guy, there was this particular guy. Maybe he messed up one time, but this guy would have treated me better. Yeah, they messed up but the one make time. Mistakes. Don't people make mistakes? We, you must. People do make people mistakes, have you, but there's you some mistakes hurt. that you can't come out of. There's some mistakes you can't. There's some mistakes you cannot. Then maybe you're not talking about a good man. I'm talking about a good man that will take you, that will respect you, that actually cares about you, that worries about you when it's like seven o'clock. You are not in the house. He's worried. I mean none. But guess what? Like, oh, that. I was with my friends. Why are you checking up on me? Yeah, he's checking up on you because he loves you. I've not had one. That's of why that, he's checking. So we'll you see. want the guy that when you are gone, he doesn't care. He's so happy you, you gone. That's the ones we whenever, meet. Whenever, whenever, no, that's not the ones. That's, you, one that's the ones I've you met. Want. That's the one I've met. Those are the ones you look at. No, the ones I want are unavailable. Well, <laughs> you know the ones I that sometimes like you want are married. Here. You all got to do things different. Mm. We all got to do things different. You all got to start looking differently. Stop looking at people's shoes. It doesn't we do nothing. Not. Stop looking at. People's are credentials. It's not doing nothing. Well, I don't think we are. Okay, me saying here, right, I can speak for me. Because right now I'm tired of speaking for women. Because every time I speak for them, they always do something stupid that make me look dumb. No, it's not like we're looking at credentials or we were even looking at shoes or whatever. And stop sleeping around too. It's 2024. Like what I'm saying. I'm speaking for myself now. So it's okay, not like speak, we are sleeping speak, around. Yeah, speak for yourself. No. <laughs> Hey, right, the Kumasa, why you always do this to us? It's 2024. Yeah, miss. We got to start new. You know? It's not like we Yo, sleep around. Your society suffers when women are not doing well. We're not sleeping around. We're just not meeting the... Like, I'm sitting here. I just want a nice gentleman. Right. I think I was having a conversation with a friend of mine on Friday. He was like, Jasmine, you're a good person. Why are you single? Right? And I was like, I just want old school type of love. Mm. And the guys that we are meeting now don't do old school type of love. Do you get what I'm saying? So it makes it hard. And a lot of these guys these days, or maybe I have not met them. So hopefully 2024, like I said, I've you opened myself up for love. You see, uh, uh, there's opportunity. It come but once, you know. It's always a lie. And you have to look at it. That what? Opportunity comes by once? Yes. You have to. You have to be on the alert for it. Yeah. You so know, um, a, a lot of people, I've seen so many women that have missed out on good men. And then the moment that the men get married, now they want them. They become you know, to them. You, 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 you push these guys away. And I feel like the problem with a lot you of women... like them because they are so skinny and bony, because they are working uh, two jobs, they're trying to build their future no. for the woman they want to be. You don't like them. I'm going to speak all on of that sudden, personally. All of a sudden, they get married. Oh, nah. the body start coming up. Oh, now you want him. Nah. Well, somebody took care of it. Nah. Are you speaking for yourself? I'm speaking for everybody. <laughs> You're speaking for yourself, I'm right? Because I have a video for you. Oh. I have a video. Nah, I had, with that video you're talking about, I have been married for like six years. And then, then we need to find another day and say, what day in six yeah, years, sis? So no. I just blew up within two years. There are some guys. Okay. I think also one of the mistakes that a lot of women make now. I can't say what I want to say anymore, so I'll just change what I want to say. One of the mistakes that a lot of women make now is that once, let's say I meet you, I like you. Be- maybe you've not, we've not started dating. A lot of people close their mind off. It's like, oh, I'm with, in, t- in their head, I'm with this person. So good men may be coming. They've okay. blocked all of that. Okay. Probably the one that they're looking at that, you know, he will make it happen, misses it. So now they have to now start all over again. Uh, That's what a lot of women are going through. It's not like we don't want love. Most of us, I'm seeing here, I want love. I want a partner, somebody that I can get off. I think yesterday I was thinking about something. I just wanted that one person I can just call and be like, this, this, and this. But then we don't have that. 
You get what I'm saying? A lot of women want it, but I feel like these guys these days have also made up their mind a certain type of way. So they're not opening themselves up for us as well. So I think the problem is not just women. It's both men and women, especially in our era. It's really hard in our era to find real love. That's the honest truth. So I'm just I, saying. I disagree with that. I still stand I, by I, that. I, dis- I disagree. I dis- I'm, I'm being serious. I disagree with Thank that. you. Chevy's young. No, I, 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 I disagree with that. It's hard no, in the streets. No, it's not. It's Must, not. If I'm not with my wife right now, I'll find somebody. Very good woman. To it's hard with. in the streets. And there are so many women that can tell you that. They are married and they still see the good guys. We see. Th- it's not like we don't see. Get, get the technique. Get a technique because if you don't see them, then there's actually so, you're gonna tell mm. me the world is filled with only evil people. Like when I say evil, like you just uh, said, people only bad people. No, we're not saying that. Like you just said right now, we want to maybe give the guy who is working two jobs all of that a chance. Sometimes we want to give that guy a chance. Sometimes we want to love on that guy, but that guy does not allow himself to be loved by us. That is the truth. That's the odd uh, gospel truth. Yeah, that's that's. That's very possible. That, that that that's very possible, but it's not always the case. Well, it's I, most of the time not the that case. That was my case. Most of the time, it's not the case. Most I'm of looking the time, at, it I'm is looking the at case. these females. Yo, if you come to a man and you make the man feel like if it's about you, what do you expect a man to do? You know, when when men naturally want to take care of women, men are getting wiser. Okay, men are getting wiser because women are acting. Yo. You know when men used to adore women and give the, uh, they would break their back for women, they would give everything that they have for women. You know what women were doing? Women were traditional women. Yeah. And when I say traditional women, most women had cookbooks at the time. They know how to cook. Most women were virgins at the time. Most women, you know, would not talk back at their men. Now you are not virgins. You can cook. You you talk back. What is this man getting from you? Mm-hmm. Like this man is gonna work all his life, make you a wife, and then you can just decide the next two days and say, "Hey, I don't want to be with you," and take everything. With this mentality for. is the reason they're no, not no, no, opening no, no, themselves no. up. That's that's what I'm trying to tell you. Because some of the women may yeah. not be virgins, but they can cook. No, no. I'm, I'm, let me finish. You understand what I'm trying to say? What I'm saying is, this has been the patterns. Of what is going on in our society right now. Women can just go to the law court and just say, I'm bored. Mm-hmm. I'm just bored. God, I can be with this man again. Mm-hmm. Guess who suffers? The man. So why do you think that a good man should sacrifice his whole life just to be with somebody that was just gonna turn one day and say, I'm bored? That's why we are all single. And so you know what you know what the deal is though? The deal is. You all should fight that system because that system that you all created didn't work good for you. Mm-hmm. So I think women should start seeing life differently instead of seeing life to be rosy. Life is not. And then when I say life, yo, I'm telling you, regardless of how you feel, regardless of how rich you are, regardless of what you think your credentials or you, your status in this world should be, I'm telling you, you are going to face at least 55% of bad times as compared to 45% of good times. That is life. We are not in the manner this. It's going to be tough. Life is super tough. Like mm-hmm. pain. People are going to be, people have chronic pain every day. They get up and, you see, life is tough, you know. So don't look at it like everything has to be rousy. So the moment things get a little bit tough than, I mean, tougher than you expected, you just leave. You know, that's all I'm talking about. You got to change. Change our dynamics. I can still speak for myself and I say there are good women who want to love on men, but the men are not there. I still stand by what I said. I'm sorry. That's what you we know. It's men with. that look for women, right? Mm. So if you are a the woman that you are attracting a bad guys, there's a problem. I, with I don't you. attract any you, bad guys. No, no, I'm that's not saying a, you. Yeah. You say you're speaking for women, right? I feel I don't think they attract bad guys. I feel like the mentality of the lot of guys lately is just more of meet you, I sleep, and I'm done because they don't want to deal with the whole. But, but you know why? I just it's not just a, it's not just a mentality. It is what has been created by women and the system. If you are with a w- woman that is telling you what a woman can do, a man, uh, what a man can do, a man can do better. You wanna you wanna be able to love? You think you can really genuinely love this person? Of course. Can you? Do you think you can love somebody that comes to the house and tell you I'm better than you? 
Oh no, that one is not. You think right. you can love that no, person? That one is not right. How many? Have you seen any woman speaking against that? Have you seen anyone come out Some and say, women you all should stop this bullshit. You women, are the reason why we are Women we are speak against it. Uh, if you're on social I media. I don't, I don't see I it. speak against it all you know, the time. You know, how, you know how you speak against them? You all should do a petition. As you were doing petitions for some, I don't want to talk about it. You all should do a petition. Go to the law courts and say that. All the, <laughs> yo, women have made, have you heard now the essay when there's a word called hero? And now they say, a hero and a heroine, right? Yeah, the lady. Now they say Shiro. Like I've, Bruh, you know, I, I've I, seen I, that one. When We're you, doing are, the you most. when you people are setting up this competition between men, you think you can play the game with men when they want to be on their A game? That's not. We can't. We can't. There's no way. There's no way. So you are prepping the men to act in their natural way, and then you are saying, "Oh, they are not treating us right." They're not. If you want to come over. And you want to play the same game with me, and you are telling me you are better than me. You think I should put myself on the fifth gear? When I put on the first gear, you can't play me. Yeah. Because I'm naturally stronger than you are. Facts. You know, so these are. Yo, I, I, I don't think far. So it's not like it's a mentality, it's a system that you guys have created. And every natural being takes care of themselves first. And now men are taking care of themselves. You know why men need sex is a man need. So even if they don't love you, they they can keep you. Still have sex, yeah. They they can keep you and marry you. But if you are giving the sex free and you are threatening him, why should this man marry you? Fact. So you all should do things differently. This was just by the way. That's fact. All I said was 2024. I want to open myself up to a nice relationship. That's all I said. You you know you know what it is. How did the nice relationship? I love. I just I just love. I want women to do better. Yo, mm. I'm telling you that any time that society is bad, mm-hmm. men suffer the most. Mm-hmm. Any time women are fighting against men, women suffer the most. You know, everything goes against women. You know, and that's why men sat down. Men built this society. Men sat down and said, no, we got to give special treatment to these people. Mm-hmm. They are vulnerable. And now they say they are better than us. We are the weaker vessel. <laughs> you know, so... We just anyway. wanted equality, okay? We just wanted to be equal. But what is the, what is equality, though? We to Do you be, think your partner comes and thinks he's better than you? No, I don't think... Do you look, think your partner comes to you and feel like you have to do certain things, he's not supposed to do anything? Well, some men feel that way. Some men feel like I'm they're too you, good. I'm, I'm glad you said something. I'm sorry. Some any men feel like they're walk, too good to... Any man that walk into your life and say, I'm too good to do something for you, <laughs> you already know. <laughs> oh, that one, I won't even continue the <laughs> like, conversation. Like, like, like you, you, already, you already know. Bye-bye. No man. Like, how am I even going to walk into my, my house and tell my wife, like, I'm the man. I'm like, it's not even I'm, I'm the Yo, man. you've never heard I mean, some I'm men the say, man. Of course I'm, I'm the man. man. You're the weaker not, vessel. You I'm need not, to listen. I'm not going to go to my wife and say, I'm better than you. Like, how dare me? Some men are like Why would I even put myself to even say, I know my space. My wife knows her space. It's about coexisting, knowing your space. Mm-hmm. You know? But you are saying you want to take over our space. Well. And you are not going to make us be who we are. And we are saying, when you come to this field, you can play with us. You can't the same way that game. we cannot we cannot multitask. Of course. When it comes to strength, you cannot. That's true. Well, let me read a few comments. Kwame Mike is on the road today. He said, love costs a lot, so we got to be on guard always. No emotions. Oh, well. He said, word Kumase. Um, then he said, they called them stalkers. I don't know when that part. Yeah, when I say, when you keep calling your woman to check up on. I have a 49-year-old woman tell me that the husband is a stock. Because he checks because on her. Because the husband calls all the time. Wow. And you've been with this man since he said. Wow. I said, I said, so this man has been like this all. He said, yeah, he's been like this all this time. I said, you've lived with this man for over 30 years. Wow. And now you're calling this man a stalker because he's showing love. Damn. Don't you think because maybe you're keeping yourself busy. That's why his actions are bothering you. Yeah. You know? Well, stalker for checking? Yeah. This man will check. Like, I, this I, man will check. I, like, I guess like, I need a stalker. He, he's, he, he, he's that man that will call you, like, every three hours. Aww. You know, he will call, hey, where are you? You know, what are you doing? Like, 
you know she's we'll complaining, like, about that. complaining about that we are praying for that yeah. oh wow but but the crazy thing is but but look at this logic the crazy thing this woman has been they, they, their first born is 30 years so let's say they've been together for 30 years 30 years let's say that and i asked this man has always been like that or he's just changed he said he's always been like that mm-hmm. Actually, it never bothered it, it bothers you now now because you have changed that man hasn't changed there's something you're doing. That's you have amazing. changed, and you want the man Freedom. to change so it can fit your schedule that you have now. You have changed. The man hasn't changed. Damn, hey, stalker for checking. Okay, well, yeah. this generation is getting sicker. And this is not even our generation because this is an older person. Dang. Um, Kwame, um, talented child said, Abba, bra kumasi. Abba, yes, leave the women alone. Thank you. Kwame Mike said, don't look for love. Look for a partner. I will explain later. The world is full of innocent guys who don't know how to vibe. That's true, too. But, I, well, I'm going to just leave it there. I'm, I'm going to leave it there. God, what it is, is we are all not the same. Women are putting tax on men. A lot of tax on men. Oh, this guy is like that. This guy doesn't have swag. This guy, women, women are, I mean, men are, women are putting tax on men. So that guy that for like, I don't fall in this group. Mm-hmm. He's kind of, you know, he's a good man. He's going to take care of you. He'll show you love if never seen. Yeah, uh, but you chose, I wouldn't say it's always 100% you cho- you chose, correct. You chose love over... Uh, and I don't think it's you always... Ch- you chose vibe over It's not even about protection. vibe. I think yesterday, uh, yesterday, it's funny, my brother and I were talking about a guy mm. that I was talking to, and I was like, he's cool. I just want somebody I can laugh with for a minute. For a second. I get it that sometimes, you know, they hold themselves back. You know, they old, like you're saying, they don't know vibes, whatever. Do women go in to help? Some women do. Some women do. We try to help, but so end when up you see, when you flipping, see a man, we become the bad guy. So when you see a man that you know that, he's a good man. So let me use uh, the dressing. That's what the women complain a lot about. Okay. So you see this guy. He's a hard worker, respectful. He will take care of you, loves you and everything. Can you go, but he can't dress good. Can you go in and say, hey, I'm going to change this. Uh, this I won't guy. go in and change totally. I'm going to go in and give suggestions. Okay. Because you have to understand that, let's just say the man is 30 years, right? Mm-hmm. Okay. Let's just say if the man is 30 years. Right. For 30 years, he has done things this way mm. or you can go in as a woman and always I always say is the approach mm. how you approach the situation mm. so if you go you can give him pointers oh babe we're going out oh why don't you wear this this and that right. a man that loves you i feel like he's going to do it you know but going and say oh i don't like this you have to do it this way i feel like that's when men have a but, problem but, but, but what you are saying is mm-hmm. you impose it it's not even imposing it. I'm going to suggest it. That, but what you just said. Oh, the like, second that, one. Yeah, okay. It's, it's, that is imposing. Yeah. No man, it's not even about men or women. Nobody. Nobody like likes that. So suggest like, it. Oh, babe. Like, let's say your your husband is wearing mm-hmm. something. Say, no, babe. Mm-hmm. You know, there are some places that. Yeah. You know, this doesn't fit where we are. We are going to try this one. Yeah. I'll no, do it. No man is going to be like, oh, I don't want. That's something I do. Some men I do. naturally. Yo, let me tell you something. Some men naturally don't know how to dress. Of Same course. way with some women. I've seen some twenty something year woman with a fifty something year old wig. I'm like, what are you doing with? What this? are you doing with your life? I've seen, I've seen those <laughs> where they can't put color coordination. I don't yeah. know whether they're color blind or I don't know how it works. But they can't be just stylish. Like, like I'm not. I'm not. I'm not a woman, right? Yeah. But I could see a woman. Like, what she wear? Yeah, I do that. All like the you time. see that from men too, right? Yeah. Like you see a woman like, ah, why? Why is she wearing that? Mm-hmm. You know. Wrong timing. Mm-hmm. They wear they wear the political suit to a casual meeting. The oversized suit. And then suits. when they go to, <laughs> and then when they go to the the meeting meeting, they, they w- put a casual one. Bro, I'm like, <laughs> what are you, know you doing? So, <laughs> women should be able to come in and say, hey, you know, and help that way. You can. A lot of men will change. Some guys, but it just change you from way. afar. Boom. I don't like his dressing. Must it's not even this, that. This Some guy. guys are stuck in their ways. You men can't are stubborn. try. You think if if you think if you think if men were easy to sway, you know where this world will be right now. Men are naturally stubborn for a reason. I men are stubborn. So if you decide that oh, 
first of all, you gotta understand anything that you want, you gotta pay a price for it. But why do you feel like I, the woman, have to put in work? What about the man? But that's what I'm just have saying. You... The man is putting in a lot of work by loving you, by protecting you, by oh, putting all these things. I together. haven't met anybody. You that's wanna like that, so. just one thing that you don't like about a man. Just one thing. And that I wouldn't even say it's a need. When it comes to fat, it's not a need. It's, it's not clothing. a need. So you chose the want over the need. And I'm telling you, if it is a, a want, you can actually do something about it. Mm. And you say, no, nah, it's hard. They're stuck in their ways. You know, it's too hard. I'm too tired of telling him to change his jacket. So I can't be with him. Well, when I meet the well, one. Well, go on with that. When I meet the it's 2024. one. 2024. We're talking about you know. 2024. Y'all got to change the world. 2024, don't worry, I'll surprise no. you guys this year. No, 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 I'm not talking and about And women, you. women will surprise you Good. this year. We'll surprise Good, you guys. Because I really want to see my girls. Like, there are some beautiful girls that I know from back in the day, and you hear, oh, I'm not married, I just broke up with my girlfriend. You're 38, you, you just broke up with your boyfriend. You're probably going to be lonely. Okay, let me read a comment on YouTube. Rena said, keep God first, that's the key. Both men and women need to be, do better. That is true. I support that. But I think her second comment, I don't understand it. If she can elaborate more, she said, Sir, goodbye. Oh, let me read in the, yeah. Sir, goodbye. You made a comment about women being a virgin and knowing how to cook. But let me ask you, can you build a house? Can you fix a car? Show me. Yes. Show I, yes. I, I, love, I like this. I love this. Can but you? Hold on, I will follow this new one. Hold on, hold on. I love this. I like that, Rena. I love it. Everything, I hope I'm seeing her name right. Everything that Rena is seeing around her is built by men. Everything. He, she's seen around. We understand, by men. but our fathers. So she doesn't, she doesn't even no, have a point. no. You said back in the day, yeah. women were virgins. Yeah. Women had cookbooks, yeah. and women, yeah. And you so, know, you, you and know, back, you know, you know what is expected of men. One second, back in the day, mm. men changed lights. Men knew how to f- do construction. Men mm. changed tires. Mm. Men knew how to fix cars. Mm. Do y'all know how to and do it, that it, now? It has never changed. I I, I know about and, a few and, men who don't but, know but how to do it. It has never changed. It has never changed, has it? <laughs> Everything, if you're talking about men, back in the day, there was no mechanic. You go to all these mechanic shop, 99% men. Mm-hmm. Go to Manhattan, a 120-story building. It's a man on it changing uh, uh, all the, uh, what we call it, the aesthetics. You, it's okay, we're not even it's talking about, men. but we're not talking about I'm outside, tell- we're talking about in the home. Oh, do your men do the traditional the, things oh, our fathers used to do? In the home. Do in y'all home. do the okay, traditional okay, things okay. our fathers who used to the do? Who grass in the home? Well, who, who, cut, uh, who, who cut the grass? Who, who plow the snow? Who check the lights? In my mother's house, that? my mother did that. Is, in my mother's house, mother, my mom mowed alone. My mom, yes, my mom is, did. Is there, is there a husband in the house? My mom did, yes. Oh, it did? She did. That itself is a problem. My if mom a did. Woman is gonna my mom did a man, all of that. If a woman is going to choose a man Shout and end up woman. working, you see, this is the problem I'm talking about. But we're asking, do y'all, okay, you mow the lawn, you plow the snow, okay, have, and then I've not, I've not even seen any, okay, let me talk even in my African community. Right? I have not seen any African woman in my African community with a husband that is plowing the snow in the oh, winter time. When it's in the winter time, it's the men in the snow. Have I seen any woman saying 50-50 on that? No woman go 50-50 on that. I've not seen any woman doing 50-50 on, 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 on the lawn. Mm-hmm. Who does that? When we have to uh, change the boiler, who does it? Change the water in the boiler, who does it? Have you seen any woman doing that before? These days, these women have to hire somebody to come do when men are in the home. So y'all men oh, want God. virgins and women. Oh, God. Y'all men, thank oh, you, Reina. You think you, somebody oh, has my God. back. Oh, y'all God. want women that are virgins and cook books and cook and all of that. We also need men that we don't have to now go the, call somebody. You see the woman? That is do, doing uh, <laughs> all this back and forth. Mm-hmm. It's a reason a lot of them are single, honestly. A lot are not too. A lot, a lot are married a with lot, men in lot, the home. A lot life. of them are single because instead of them to... Who is she? I like her. Instead of them to... <laughs> instead like of her. them to listen to understand, they are listening to reply. No, we're listening to tell you guys that <laughs> as much as you guys are we expecting old school no, from us, we no, want no, no, old no. school love No, we are too. not expecting old school from you because we mm. are not in the old school. What I'm saying is back in the day, People were doing all these things to help. 
Men were breaking their back and they were getting things in return. Mm. Now, what are we getting in return? Before a man married, marries you, you're already been with like 10 guys. Mm-hmm. This is not me making this up. Before a woman marries all of y'all, you guys have been with a hundred women. You know who gives carrying us, herpes, you know, you know, carrying. You know, you know who give access to sex? Men and women now, <laughs> right now. Anybody? So before yeah. any woman argue the point that I'm talking about, you have to understand who give access to sex. I've not seen any man <laughs> reported a, a woman of rape before. I've, I have. I've, I've not seen that. We heard it. Chevy, is- Chevy, have you seen that? A, a, a man running to the police station reporting a woman of rape. I've seen a rape. woman of rape, yeah. <laughs> During the Me Too While movement, to I saw a right. lot. That, mm-hmm. that, that, was, that was a man trying to make a stance. No, I saw a lot of men coming but out saying, saying women is, rape them. I'm saying they're just trying to make a stance. All Have I'm, you seen a normal life where a man a man, a man, man and a, a woman, right, mm-hmm. in the house, mm-hmm. and then the man just, we have wives reporting their husbands of rape. That's a conversation for another day. That's, you, that's you're not, trying to deviate. No, I'm not you, deviating. What deviating. I'm saying is, <laughs> women give access to sex. So if you are telling me my men are sleeping with women, who gave access to that? It's women. Okay, so it's who is some the women. women. The same way you are saying that. It's a, it's a, it's a <laughs> Let me read my girl's comment. I like this one. I really like her. <sighs> um, These men insist. Okay, wait. We are not in back in the days. We are. We are in the now fact. These men are limited. He has to understand these men have have let society trick them until they think they need to be babied. Yes. The men that feel like they need to be treated like children. Oh, let me tell you. Have you met those men? Oh, God. I know about those. Let me tell you about those. Pissing me off. Go up. You know what? It is women that are going sleepovers to men that are not married to them. It is women. It is women that are cooking for men that are not married to them. It is women. But hold on. Hold on. (laughs) No, 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 no. no. You can't do that. Free food, free sex. Hold on, hold on. you baby me? No, no. We can't. You know why we cannot do that? You know what? No, we can't do that. I love her so much. I like her. Wait, let me let me tell you why we can't say that. We okay because maybe I'm in a relationship where I'm talking to a guy and I cook for you, I make a meal or two for you. There's not thank you. Does not mean like I'm cheap. It just means maybe I just want to feed you because maybe I came to your house, I opened your fridge, and maybe you needed food, so feed the children. So I fed you. Maybe I come sleep at your house because maybe we're watching a movie. I'm tired and I fall asleep. I fall asleep. <laughs> so let's not. Yeah, tra- tra- traditional <laughs> woman. Yes. The woman. I tra- as, a, be so traditional. as a traditional woman, the, the woman that I like be so traditional. <laughs> saying that I came to your house and I fell asleep. As a, as a traditional woman, what I'm saying, I is, like to cook for my man. I like to fool for my guy women, friends. Women are expecting men to do things for them. Yes. That they themselves have devalued themselves themselves so much that they don't even deserve. So that. you're saying now no more sleepovers. Check. But, but in reality, let me tell you this. Uh-huh. In reality, why would you want to go sleep with somebody that haven't made the uh, uh, the, the the most or the how do I put it? They've the done ultimate, the bare minimum. The, the, no, no, the, the ultimate uh, promise to you. That's the, true. Why will you go sleep with that yeah, person? Yeah, that's a That person get you pregnant. Okay, so let's say you live in Ohio right now. Mm-hmm. I could come. To, you can come to my place, mm-hmm. go sleep with me. The next day, you get pregnant. That, boom, I move. I move to Alaska. You're probably not gonna find me again. Mm-hmm. Who is stuck with it? The woman. Stuck? So if you are going back and forth on me, blaming somebody that can cause more damage to you, uh-huh. you are fooling yourself. Well, let me continue reading my women supporting I, I women lo- I comment. That. I really like. I hope I'm saying her name right. So if I'm not saying it right, I'm so sorry, girl. Um, is it Reina or Rihanna? Rihanna. I'm gonna just call it that way. And her next one was these. These are the men who should raise our families, who we should trust to go. She was talking about the babies part. Yeah, the baby part. She said, these are the men we should raise, who should raise our families, who we should trust to go to, to go to God, to, to go to God, to lay the foundation and break physically and spiritually. Where are they? I do agree. Okay, let me read that again. So sorry. These are the men who should raise our families, who we should trust to go to God, to lay the foundation and break physically and spiritually. Where are they? I do agree with you. 
I do agree with you. We must carry ourselves or must carry yourself as a top tier God fear woman to attract this type of men. So we must carry ourselves so we can attract the men that you are saying. And then her next thing was, oh, shout out to Imani Deval. And then our next, her next one was, I agree with your point. We should not be sharing our bodies in that way, but we do. We fall weak to the flesh every time. We need to do better. Thank you. I, I agree with that. We uh, fall can, weak. Can the man that do not pay child support say I fell weak and I can't pay child support? That's different. The, you created oh, a human. No, that is different. That is different because you created a human. You gave access to sex. Let me go That's to what Facebook. I'm to, <laughs> that's what I'm trying to tell you. No. Yo, women are so special that if women do understand how special they are, they, 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 we wouldn't even have these excuses. That okay. It, so it then, was, I'm telling you. Mm, uh, uh, I, I don't like know how Rena. I don't know how old Rena is, but Rena may be thirty and 20s, below. Yeah, thirty and below. Guess what? Who is raising these boys? Rena is talking about is the women. Seventy to eighty percent of divorces are initiated by women. Who is pushing the men out? Women. The problem is not men. Okay. Let's sit down for a minute. I'm not blaming. The problem women. is men too. I'm not blaming women, but let's sit down for a minute. Uh huh. We have women going around and say, "I just had a one night stand in the in the club. One night stand in the club. Yeah. Somebody that you may never see again. Mm. Boom! A child is out of this. You gonna blame the man for it? You knew you could get pregnant. You still made that decision. Mm-hmm. The man is not going to carry... Men will never understand women. Women know who they are. And if women make these decisions, this world will be better. But what we are also saying is, yes, we understand that there are women who are promiscuous. There are women, yes. And all, I always say this, that sometimes as a woman, you might be like, okay, I'm going to hold on. The spirit is willing, but the flesh is weak. I'm so sorry. Like you are saying, yes, we shouldn't Your give it up. didn't do it like that. Well, God, our mothers got married when they were 16. I am 20, almost 9. Our mothers got married when they were 16. All we are saying is sometimes it's not like we want to give it out. It's not like we just want to just sleep. Sometimes it's, let's stop pretending. I don't, I don't care. I we don't fall care how, weak. I don't care how weak you can be. A woman that goes to the club and just lift no, the face and say, do one night That one is me. different. That's, that one is different. It's that one is a no. That one is different. That's a no. But we're saying, I'm talking about women like what Rena was saying. Sometimes we're with a partner. And then maybe we are hanging out. The spirit is willing, but the flesh is weak. And then we fall and we, you know, we sleep together. That one is different. <laughs> okay. He said we fall and sleep together. Yeah. I, like that kind of I fell. Like the devil <laughs> chided. What, 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 I'm what we to, are okay. saying is okay. that sometimes we want to, you know, hold on. You know, I want to hold till there's a ring on my finger. But then the body wants a, what the body I've seen wants. A lot of guys mm-hmm. telling women that I don't want to sleep with you. I want to be able to, you know, do the right thing. This is where I say, that, oh, man, I, I don't know. He's lame. He's lame. Yeah. I don't like this kind of man. He's lame. It's not like... Yo, we it, want it, it right it, now. It, it doesn't we, matter whatever we put in. Where's Rita? <laughs> we the God-fearing love, love, women, we want it. We God-fearing women, we want it. But something, the devil tries us. <laughs> okay? We fall. It's temptation. It's temptation. All <laughs> oh, what I'm saying is, you, you know, and, and as I'm saying that, how respectful I am of women. When I say these things, somebody may sit somewhere and say, oh, he's bashing on women. It's not. I feel like if women <laughs> make a decision, you know when, even when you read the Bible, when Jacob was going to go look for the uh, wife called uh, Rahel, he Rachel, put in work. whatever, right. he put in seven years of work. Yeah. In the family tradition, the older woman is supposed to be married, right? Before the younger one. The, he put in another seven, another years, seven years, right? Yeah. Why do you think he would put in seven years? He saw because the he value. The so we have to he place a value the, on ourselves. So what I'm saying is if women don't give sex, men become rapists and it becomes a crime. So if you are giving it, <sighs> what you expect me to do? Because I need it. And you are giving it for free. Let me That's read comments Please do. from other men called Kwame Mike. Um, Kwame Mike said, yeah, bre, I suppose you were tired. Talented child. Child, sorry. But when the man is not changing the light or fixing broken stuff in the house, the woman can't see and watch. The world has changed. Yeah, it is true. It is very true. Okay. Very, very, very true. It is very, very true that when you are, you know, we are mm-hmm. supposed to be partners. Mm-hmm. You know, if I cannot do something, you take care of it. Yeah. Right. But what I'm saying is it's a primary responsibility of okay. the man to do that. When somebody walks into my house and my kids are wayward, Nobody's going to say, say, oh, my wife didn't trade the case well. 
It's the man. Are Even sure? when, yeah. Are you sure? Is your man? Because most of the time because when the kids seeing, are bad, because you are seeing most of the time you are seeing the single homes. Uh, most of these families are single homes. Yeah. That's why now we are blaming women. If you live in a, a, a home of a mother and oh, my papa was here. I think yeah. Where's your Yo, father? I'm telling you, even if your wife is not doing the right thing, the man get blamed, not the woman. Okay, Kwame Mike said, what Kumasi is saying is that there's no return on investment in marriage for men. I disagree on that one. But Kwame Mike also said, men are only pushing for you to be vir- men are only pushing for you to be virgins, which will benefit women, yet we are seen as the bad guys. Kwame Mike said, Kumasi is speaking facts. He will always support you as men. And I then I don't think it's bad. Kwame Mike said, Jasmine, everything gonna be all right. <laughs> I'm gonna block them. I'm gonna block him. Kwame Mike, I'm gonna but, block but you. In reality, do you think whatever I'm saying is bashing women or I'm saying what I see in society? Well, okay, we understand what you are saying, but I feel like a lot of times, okay, I want to read this comment first, then I can, okay, I'll read it after. Well, it's not like we agree, I, I trust me, I agree with what you're saying, that like, if we put a price, if we hold ourselves on a higher pedestal, then men will approach us differently. Because we have given ourselves out loosely, men look at us like we are loose. And I also want to say that not all women... Some most women are doing that. There are women who have done that, who have decided we deserve better, who have changed. They deserve a chance too. But yes, women, we need to do better because I think it was it this morning I was reading a story of two girls who went to Miami for a week or two and they decided to go, you know, random and they're both pregnant. And now they're trying to find out who's responsible, but they still, at this point, you can't find out who it is. And most of the comments under it were women saying, we need to do better. So it's not like we don't know. We know. And we are trying to put that message out there. But the more we put it out, y'all just come back. But I'm, and not seeing, I'm not seeing women petitioning. I've seen women petitioning to change words in, in the dictionary. I've not seen women petitioning... To stop all this kind of lifestyle. I've I not th- seen them. We, when ha- you start see, doing those, I take your We can't serious. go on matches that women should do better. We Why can't. can't you? What we can do is as a sister. Men, men check men every day. If I see, if I see Chevy. Y'all don't check no men. Chevy, then y'all sh- hold on. If I see Chevy not taking care of uh, the wife, I say, what the? He's a bomb. You know y'all don't do Chevy, that. I would say, Chevy, you a bomb. You really? Don't take care of your child? Y'all do that. Oh, man. Where it is easier for how many times have you had a uh 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 let's say a forty year old woman advise you, please do this, don't do this, don't do this. Women don't check women. Yeah, it depends. Men, men check men all the time. I don't see it. I easily call Chevy. Yo, you gotta do this. You gotta do this. How many times have I spoke to you about your relationships? How many times do women call uh, young girls and they are competing? Your life is about competition. <laughs> what I'm trying to tell, what I'm trying to tell you right now is. This life will be better when women are better. And that's why everything that is set up is to help women. But women have decided, no, we're going to take advantage of that. So Rina said, if I heard my husband saying the problem is women, I would be disgusted. Take accountability for your part in the downfall as a man. No one is perfect, especially not... Not the black or African man. Get off your pedestal. Both Adam and Eve, Eve fell short. Amen, sister. Amen. Y'all wanna, blame you wanna, women. You go in no. The Bible? Let me go with my girl wanna, real quick. You, you want to go in the Bible? You have an open Bible. Calm down. <laughs> y'all are quick to point the fingers at women. What about y'all? Y'all should also take accountability for your thing. If the woman is busting her, then open in the club. You could also control yourself by keeping it in your let, pants. Let me tell you. Just saying. Let me tell you. No. The fire. No. The fire and the hands. Which of them supposed to take care of the, themselves? Mm-hmm. Protect themselves. Between the fire and the hands. Which of these objects have to take care of themselves? The hand. No, the fire. Ija fire. Uh-huh. And the hand. Which of them supposed to protect themselves? Any the head? Do you understand what I'm saying? No. I okay. don't get it. This is a hand. This. Oh, hand. hand. This is a fire. I heard head. Okay. Or oh, whatever. Hand, whatever. <laughs> Which of them is supposed to protect them? The health? hand. The so, hand. So where's this comment even coming from? The only person. The woman and no. the man. You're both humans. No, both no. of you we protect both, yourself. We are both humans. We are both humans. By who is complaining? Who is suffering? It's the woman. 
whoever is suffering from a decision have to change their ways. Men are not suffering. It's women that are suffering. <sighs> Men are not suffering. Think about it. Men are not suffering. Mm -hmm. 82% of uh, wealth in this world is in the hands of men. Men are not suffering. It's women that are suffering. I'm saying the actions of women is creating this. He's saying, oh, we have to take accountability. Yes, we've, take, we've taken accountability. That's why we're 82% in the wealth. I'm not telling you what she is saying. I'm not saying men shouldn't take accountability. That's not what I'm saying. Mm -hmm. I'm saying women give access to all these things to happen to them. The criminal will always be a criminal. You have to take... You think the bully wouldn't want to be a bully? The bully will always be a bully mm -hmm. until the bully is challenged. If you don't make that to decision to protect yourself, nobody's going to say, oh, he's weak. I'm going to take care of He's weak. People will always take advantage of you. That's true. You know, so in as much as you don't want to hear it, you're going to hear it because this is the route. Men are not leaving their wives. It's women that are leaving their husbands. Mm -hmm. Men, yo, do you know how many percentage of people, uh, 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 men's money that goes into, uh, uh, what we call it, snaps and food stamps and Medicaid and all this? 72% of income from men goes into it. Guess how many of men are on all these food stamps and all that? You're men are taking fine. care of women. All these food stamps and all that are, are being given to women. Men don't even qualify. I, I'm a <laughs> you woman. Go there, I don't qualify. You go there, you don't even qualify. What I'm saying is, we are taking care of them, and men don't care about these things. Men will work hard to take care of women. What I'm saying is, if a man want to sleep with you, if a man, if you are going around and say, I've seen, you go on social media, women that are celebrating, I have 200 body counts. I have, they are happy That's about disgusting. it. disgusting. You know how, haven't you seen those videos? They're everywhere. Literally. Women are celebrating their body counts. Women, women are so proud to say, I slept with a man, a, a, a guy and a father. So happily. Wait, wait. <laughs> That's nasty. I've heard man, about the man, man, man and When father, a man does but... that, a man don't carry a baby. Woman carry a baby. That's it's, nasty. Yo, I'm saying that if a woman does one mistake, the aftermath of that mistake is catastrophic as compared to a man. <sighs> That's all I'm saying. I'm not saying every mistake in this world is a man. I mean, it's a woman. That's not what I'm saying. I'm saying that when a woman makes a mistake, it hits everybody. And we got to do things right. When a woman tells me, I can't sleep with you. I don't like you. Even if I call you, keep calling you, you can't get restraining order on me. Yeah. Right? Mm -hmm. I could be a rapist. I, mm -hmm. So if a woman don't give me the chance, how many of this birth results in it? It's only 1% of birth that results, uh, I mean, in rape. It's only 1%. So it's not even significant. You know, so all these births that we are having, this 78% of kids from uh, out of wedlock, it's women giving access to crazy guys that they know these guys are not going to take care of the, uh, of the kid and they are still sleeping with them. You want me to blame the man for that or the woman for that? Who is the kid? Both. Who is the kid stuck? I still stand with both. Why both? A man can also still practice self-control. Why both? A man can practice self-control. When the man is only getting benefit and no punishment, will you? Will you yes. think about it? Will you? But sex is if, beneficial to both parties, the woman and the man. But let's the be end, honest. But, both but people on, enjoy. On. At the end of the day, mm -hmm. the woman carry the result. The baby. Of it. Yeah, but the man and can that also can practice. Be catastrophic. But the man I have should seen also a practice. a woman it. go paralyzed after having a child. Oh yeah. No man go paralyzed after having sex. <laughs> I'm just telling you that most of this hard job is on the woman. We understand what you are saying. We also want men to hold themselves accountable as well for the decisions that they make. That's all we are also asking And for. I'm asking how? You guys can also practice self-control. I'm so sorry. Y'all can also zip it up. Keep it in your pants. It all the balls the same. Keep, <laughs> it, keep it in your pants. <laughs> you know, practice self-control. You, know, you know how control. she say, men should practice self-control, yes. right? There's Women no are the weaker vessel. There, That's there, what the there, Bible there is, says. There is, there is no person that... Right now, you right now, I don't see you to be a thief, right? Yeah, no. But I bet you when you're walking down the street right now and uh, Chase is opening up and there's money everywhere, you are not a thief. 
you are gonna grab some. I'm robbing the, the bank. Are you not grabbing some of it? I'm robbing that the bank. You a thief. You know what they supposed to do? They're supposed to lock up. Yeah, it was their fault. And yes, and Please now they tell them to open it up. Now. They got to lock up when the women. Lock we are up. locking up, but we're also asking the men because no, the thing oh, is. Oh, now you are asking. <laughs> <laughs> now we, the tone change. Our lives asking. Us. We understand that we're supposed to zip up, but sometimes, like she said, my sister said it perfect. The spirit is willing, but the flesh is weak. You guys should also sometimes practice self control. So if we're coming on to you, you guys be like, "Yo, calm down." <laughs> no, give a us vibes. Men have done it. Some lame. men don't. We'll take your lame. They re- take oh, the oh, L and go. You take the lame, L and go. And they go and back off you to the whole society. It's better. At least you've practiced self control. A, a man's status is more important to him than anything. A man's body, keeping a man's body holy, is also very important. Thank you very much. But yeah, today we're not even supposed to talk about relationship. But is it, it not, was supposed to be what we do twenty twenty four. A new direction. Child support is accountability. <laughs> <laughs> Kwame Mike said that. Only you would say that. <laughs> you know, most men will naturally take care of their kids. Yes or no? Oh, yeah. Most men will naturally take care of their kids. Yeah. Me, child support, I don't really see it to be a punishment. I don't think it's even... Me, I told a friend of mine. A friend of mine and the wife went through, you know, and I said, take yourself to child support. He said, man, I don't want to be... I said... The, how are you going to document everything you give to this woman? Because mm-hmm, they will later come back and Put yourself to child support so you don't have to deal with this woman's craziness. Mm-hmm. Just put yourself to child support. But he wouldn't do it. I was like, well, if my wife leaves me today, I'll put myself to child Why? support. Why? Take care of your child. I'll take care of your child, but mm-hmm. women can just switch up one day. That's true. So that's why you keep track of everything that you do. You, court don't care. The court system don't care what you keep track of. Lately, they actually... Yo, the you know, court system don't care. Lately, have you watched the child support shows Yo, that they've been doing? They say, they, go, they, cha- they don't care. They can put you... Like, you could be earning 100000 mm-hmm. a year, right? Mm-hmm. And then let's say they will put you on. Let's say, give the child 1500 a month. Mm-hmm. Right. Okay, cool. I can afford that. 1500 a month. Go back. Guess what? In the next two years, you're making 48... 48, uh, let's say, 48... Thousand. Mm-hmm. You they still, don't care. Yeah, you still gonna pay that amount, except if the, you have a the good court, lawyer. The court system don't care. Yeah, that's what I'm telling you. Keep, keep yourself on the system, so the government is a witness to everything that you are doing. Oh boy, well, but they can switch up on you. Well, this is not what we're supposed to talk about. So Thursday we're going to con- 2024. What are you going to what do is different? New, what is what is, is the same thing? But yeah, done. I'm glad though because now we can learn that in this new year we should hold ourselves on a higher. We can't keep higher. doing the same thing. We can't keep yeah. this, doing the same thing. You are in the church. Let me talk to the church girls. Reina is a church girl, right? Yes, yeah, she you are in the she's church. A girl, so yeah, yeah, you are in the church. There's a lot of young guys in the church. A lot of guys. Let's not talk about the church guys. I'm so sorry. Oh, why? It's ghetto the, in the church. What's the problem? It's then? ghetto. What's the problem? It's then? ghetto. What's the problem? The problem is the church guys now are worse than the club guys. Oh. Yeah. Okay. Why you say that? That's so sarcastic. That's scary. Okay. When Kumasi does that, that's so okay. scary. <laughs> and I'm like worried. <laughs> what is the okay? I've only met like two, three good church guys. But they're like, now you know why it's they're like younger that? Than you know me, why so. it's like that, right? Why? Because you'll push the good ones away. <laughs> no. How? Good guys come to church. They probably have their beard. Oh, you don't like these guys? They probably have their tattoos. We the young girls pro- like them. They probably like, don't like these guys. They like the guys that will act a certain way, put on a face, give you the facade, and then boom, 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 including uh, the pastor's wife. On that note, on that note, on that note, let me end my show before Facebook cancels my show. Yes, it's over an hour now. (laughs) What the heck did the pastor's wife do to y'all? Yo, I'm telling you, this kid's... the church is focusing on mm. I, um, identity elimination. Mm-hmm. They just look at you. You don't fit the regular church guy. Mm-hmm. It's not part of us. They sideline them. Oh, this person, they start making remarks of you. They try to talk to the girls. So That's... when you see, even when this guy is trying to get closer to any of the girls, oh, no, 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 no. This guy is not good for you. Look at the way he's dressed. Look at the way. They, do, they do all these things, and then they... So now what they do is they eliminate like 10, 15, 20 guys. Mm-hmm. 
Mm-hmm. And then there's like eight guys. 32 girls. Mm. <laughs> mm. It's equal to four each. Mm. Mm. Equal to four each. Mm. Do you think they should bring polygamy back? Oh, yeah. That's a question I've always wanted. But polygamy to. has been the best system. My grandfathers and forefathers were... So you allow your sister to be married like what a second wife? Okay, good. Thank you. My sister probably sleeping with two guys at the same time. Damn, calm down. I'm not sleeping like, with what two... Is, the sister is me. What, what, calm down. Don't let people with, believe that I'm but, sleeping but, but, with... But, but, no, but, no, no, no. Let's correct it. I'm not sleeping I with two said guys. the sister is probably... I said your sister. And I people said, are looking at me. And I said the sister is probably... But I'm not. <laughs> Just say I that. Because people I said come probably... The sister, because people really but, listen but yo, to yo, but, but in reality, but look at this from this point of view. In reality, mm-hmm. look at how we end relationships, about how we get into the new one. It's within a gap of one month, two months. They're in a new relationship. I didn't do one month. No. Why you keep putting yourself in every situation? <laughs> I'm not talking about you. No, but look, at, you, look at your society. Look I don't at your think friends. it's one month, two months. I doubt it. I don't think so. Some are even weak. <laughs> some are the same day <laughs> no no the thing is when we are breaking up with you we you need backup uh-huh. so then once so we break up I don't sit and cry I don't want to sit and I'm cry so I have to replace Chevy therapy no we don't need that kind of therapy okay. I need right okay. after I leave you I go to Chevy once the day I'm leaving Chevy I'm jumping that's why most of the kids are becoming a problem confusion pregnant for this one this one is the one Fertilizing it. Mm. <laughs> and the kid come out confused. <laughs> Not fertilizing, <laughs> man. Not fertilizing. Fertilizing. No, my mind went somewhere else. <laughs> and then the kids come out confused. And I'm saying that, yo, like this life, that, 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 that's the lifestyle I'm talking about. We can't keep living this lifestyle. Hmm. Right? Mm-hmm. Between a man and woman, who goes to who the most? If you are in a relationship, who goes to whose house the most? I think it's supposed to be the woman goes to the man's house the most. Yeah. So naturally, most of men, men don't really cheat like that. It's easier for a woman to cheat than a man cheating. Why? You can go to a man's house the yo, most and he's yo, still going to cheat. So, so, so look at it this way. Please. If I got a girl right now, mm-hmm. I'm, I'm going to take a, the girl home. Of How course. many times can I afford a hotel? Really? I'm going to take a girl home. Right, but if the so, girl doesn't have so, a key to your house, well, you on, can still. I'm cheat. saying, I'm saying, I'm taking the girl home. Yeah. Okay. If I have a serious girlfriend, probably they be living together. Like me, I'm married. I'm married. <laughs> Let me use perfect example. I'm married. If I take a girlfriend right now, <laughs> it becomes a money business for me. Because hotel, I can't. Is expensive. It's, it's hotel is expensive. Apartments are I can't cheap. Take, okay, so let's say my wife has a two-hour interval. I'm gonna sneak her in. Mm. How many times can I do that? If my wife is cheating, they can easily and gladly walk majestically into another <laughs> man's room with no problem. Mm-hmm. You see what I'm saying? With no problem. That I'll never find out because what am I going to do in that, that <laughs> guy's house? Room? Yeah. But my wife will be coming home. <clears throat> That's different, but I'm telling you, women can do better. Trust me. If women change their ways, men naturally changes. Or women. Yo, men go around the world killing just just for a woman to be okay. Back in the day, men would go to war for one girl. Go kill thousands of people just for one girl. Man, I'm looking for that type of Men thing. are willing for to do me. everything. If women change, men will follow. Men will naturally become disciplined if women are not willing to open their legs. Men will marry women the more if... Women are not taking men into the court system, yeah. de- degrading their name, making them nothing. Men will marry the most. So w- the moment things change with women, men naturally follows. Mm-hmm. And that's what I'm talking about. It's not to degrade anybody. Well, on that note, Kwame Mike said when it was your fertilization, he said DNA confusion, pa. Well, on that Yo, I've seen the DNA get confused. How many times they, they there was this case that Maury did no. What's that that one? The other one. Walkers. The divorce court. Okay, okay. And they did it three times inconclusive. 
Do you know that can happen? Yeah. It can be two men having one baby. Yeah, yeah that's uh, yeah, it has happened before. It's crazy. Man. There was actually twins. One was for another man. Yeah, one but, was yeah, for that, another that man. That is different. That's the uh, uh, what we call it. The Fatana twins, whatever they call them. It can easily happen. The one's baby yeah, for one man and two then twins, uh, twins, and then two different dads. Two different dads. That's yeah. crazy, though. Yeah, cause some if if I have sex with you today. I can break one egg, yeah. and I have sex with you the next day, and I break the other egg. So if that sex wasn't, the second sex wasn't your husband, and it's with another guy, that person broke that egg. Scrambled That's eggs. why you look at some of you, some of your kids, and you're like, uh, this kid. Are you sure? <laughs> <laughs> the way he behaves. <laughs> it's like, oh. Uh. <laughs> that All is right. true. But on that note, thank you guys so much for a great show. Look, what are you doing different 2024? Put it in the comments below. We are going to read it. And for our Thursday show, what are you doing different this 2024? We want to know what you're doing. But thank you guys so much for watching. Today's show was sponsored by Quick Copy, Believe It's Attire, RG Kids, Akuba, Lona Soul Streetwear, Glorious Studios, Rock Vine, Valentine's Dinner, and Dance. Thank you guys so much for get, for watching. Please don't forget to hit the subscribe button, the follow button, the like button, the comment button. You can find us on all platforms. It's Revolt Media. I was here with the God himself, the bullheaded man, and then Kumasi I'm sorry, and we were produced by Chevy with the X. Thank you guys so much for watching. We'll catch you guys tomorrow on Revolt Drive and on Thursday for... All that matters. I'm your girl, Akuba Jasmine, and I'll catch you next time. Bye-bye for now. Bye.